Right, so I have now welded in this extra plate that goes across. It's uh, got that flat edge in there. Um, I've drilled some holes into the top because I need to be able to feed the bolts in from the top. Now, the holes still aren't big enough to get the head of the nut in, but I'm going to have to do that tomorrow at work with my, with my special die grinder, just to make those holes a little bit larger. There'll still be enough structural support around it, especially with this, this plate in here and, and everything. So, um, And then it's, it's also going to have to be large enough to fit a socket in there, uh, something to, to hold the, the bolt still. But um, apart from that, I've got this here. I've um, got one of the rubber mounts and I've just uh, taken a, a, an edge off of those two there just because it, um, just, just to make it fit in into the screw a bit nicer. And then this whole thing is going to sit right there. So now I'm going to move on to the three feet. Going to drill the holes in the plates, um, get them lined up where I want them, drill the holes in the chassis, and then start fitting the rib nuts. Right, here's the uh, the plates, holes drilled out on them. Now I've drilled these out to a uh, they're a 10 mil bolt and I've drilled these out to a 10.5 so there's a little bit of a little bit of play in there which is going to be good.